franchise. Tour. We're out here making pumpkins or jack-o'-lanterns. And my husband says, you always have to use power tools. So, he's going to use power tools to do his pumpkin. So, what are you going to use that for, baby? The eyes? Nice. Wow. Were you expecting it to make that big of a mess? Not really. It's cool. Not going to stop you, though, is it? Nope. <laughs> oh, those are some nice circles. Like father, like daughter. Mm -hmm. Now, I don't want the pumpkin shooting across the table. I don't know how to do this. You know how to do this? Yeah. As it flies across the room? <laughs> I don't know if I want smaller eyes or not, though. You can do smaller eyes. If you want. I'm going to laugh if this thing takes off on you. Mm. Ah, they're a little crooked. Let me see. <laughs> but hey, bowling ball. I think you need another hole for that. Wait, how does it touch on this one? Is it just a... Yeah, just a twist. Oh, it's a twist. Okay. Yeah. You can use the marker? For the nose. For the nose? Or you can give him a round nose, too. Nah. Try the nose. I'll figure it out here. There you go. You just wait till it clicks? Yeah. Oh, holding on is cheating. What? Let me see. Yep. The holes aren't that bad. Mm. You're cutting that with a steak knife. Mm -hmm. Please don't cut a hand off. Don't want to go to the emergency room. Let me oh, see, Tiff. Mine came out a little bit lopsided, too. A little bit more than your dad's, but yeah. it gives it expression. It has to have expression. So tell us what you heard on the news. Oh, well, it wasn't on the news. It was just like an article online about how Texas has a body farm where um, forensic students monitor decaying bodies and stuff. And usually people who donate their bodies to science just end up dumped in the middle of these places underneath cages so animals and stuff don't get to them uh-huh and then they just observe and watch them decay which is pretty interesting and they showed pictures and stuff too of all the decaying corpses gross and you thought that was cool it was cool i have a warped daughter you know maggots eat like the face first and the brain and everything else before moving on to the rest of the body <laughs> so much for family taping sorry <laughs> People are getting an insight of how warped my family truly is. So, favorite Halloween? I guess I'd be back in Idaho. Oh. What's wrong? Oh, uh, like. Oh, uh, nothing. What? what? Oh, right, right here. His eye kind of like dips a little bit. Oh, yeah. Character. Yeah, yeah character. So, how are we doing over here? What kind of math are you doing? I'm not sure. I just did a triangle nose. Oh, so. uh, okay. I'm How not sure what we? Kind of mouth. Huh? Hmm? You're gonna do what? I'm not sure what kind of mouth. Oh. We can do poke circles and then just kind of even it out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're into using that drill, aren't you? Mm, that was a good idea. <laughs> I definitely have to use a small bit. Men and their power tools. You got this one? The one fourth? I'm not sure if that's 
be too big though. Okay, what are you going to do, Tiff? I haven't figured out yet. And there's several different mouths, but... So do you have any other details that aren't so morbid to tell us that you learned? From the article or in general? In general. Well, I know how to do a cold cylinder check on an engine. <laughs> I did ask, didn't I? Yep. I meant along the lines of Halloween, oh. not fixing jet engines. Oh, it wasn't a jet engine. Yeah, it was a reciprocator. Reciprocator. Okay, I should explain this. Her dad works on fighters. And jet engines. She, jet engines, sorry. And she is taken after him, and she's going to school to do the same thing her dad did. She's going to college. And what are you going to be? An AMP. Okay. You want to explain that to people? Mechanic for airplanes. Oh, it's not very technical? No, not really. <laughs> but you're going to do it without joining the military. So how's your pumpkin coming, baby? And this one retired from the military and just went back to work for him. The Halloween we had in... Um, Idaho, we really did it up. We um, did creatures coming out of the ground, tombstones, had a, a TV in the window with the black sheet around it, and all you saw was this videotape of this woman in a crystal ball doing out warnings and fortunes and all that. And then on the porch, my husband rigged it where the rocker would rock, and we had a ghoul in it. Then we had bats on strings that went around the top, and a bunch of fog, and what else did we have? Oh, we had the guy that glowed, and the, the uh, cemetery entryway to come in, and then a walkway with skulls and crossbones. It was pretty cool. Of course, we had to put skull parts all over the yard. We even had to take a uh, video of it. Actually, I wish we had. Anyway, when we get back to getting these pumpkins close to being done, I will let you see them, and then hopefully I can talk my daughter into showing us her costume that she did for her and her boyfriend. So here's the finished product of our not-so-scary jack-o'-lanterns. Morbid talk and cheery jack-o'-lanterns. Isn't that an oxymoron? Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. Tiff, what are you doing? Uh, cleaning. Oh. I know what your dad's going to do. Separate and bake the seeds. Yep. Well, you got to soak them in uh, salt water overnight and then he'll bake them tomorrow. Okay, well, we got the pumpkin part done. Now it's time to go make some tacos before we get costumes and go trick-or-treating. Okay guys, say happy trick-or-treat. Happy <laughs> trick-or-treat. Or happy Halloween. <laughs> okay, Joey is a paper boy from the 40s. 40s, 30s. 40s, 30s. <laughs> Cigarette woman here, but she's going to put candy in for the kids. Oh, yeah. My Check daughter. <laughs> huh? Check-out people. Yeah. Yeah, check out people. Ninja. <laughs> My daughter Tiffany and her boyfriend Joe, they're ninjas. Where's your swords? <laughs> Show them your blue oh, swords. Oh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> yep. Okay, wish everybody a happy Halloween, guys. Happy, happy Halloween. Halloween. Bye, hope everybody has a great night and happy Halloween. <laughs>